And here we are. Matt looks like he's actually belongs in that wheelchair. You're finally actually disabled. <laughs> click, 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 click. to episode number 23 click, of the Mighty click. Michael Fully Actual Podcast. And this week, we got Jimbo Jono here for the episode. We got a ripping, rip snortler oh. of an episode. We got... I did Tinder Tinder conversations all week, so we got some banger conversations. Yes. We got Matt versus Michael. We got prank call. And not to mention that Mr. Brown is in a fucking wheelchair. And this time... He it's belongs needed. there. Yeah. <laughs> it's real. So you've actually done damage to your body. Yeah, a little bit. What did doctor say? Doctor didn't say much. What do doctor say when you come in? What you say? Doctor said you can't walk fluid. That's racist. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> holy <laughs> shit. Fucking hell, man. <laughs> we all know now it was an, an Asian doctor. <laughs> <laughs> that's what it sounded like. Yeah, that's what you made it sound like. I was just mimicking Marty. So you got <laughs> fluid. Yeah, it's just, it's just uh, swollen. Um, so yeah. you went to the gym and then you woke up the next day and your knee was all swelled up like a breast. <laughs> no, it came up on, it came late. It was like a couple of days. Maybe people will be able to help. What's that mean? Yeah, so uh, <laughs> so a swollen knee, a stiff swollen knee with huge sack of fluid yeah, on at it. at the top. What does that mean? Show the comparison. Show the other one so people can well, it's see. Well, it's just, I don't know if it is a sack of fluid. i got to get an, uh, yeah, a I scan. can literally so see it you, jiggle when you move it. So you're going to get it scanned. <laughs> yeah, you, I've got to get a scan. Are you worried? What if they need surgery to perform on your no. patella? No, she said... She said to me, you'd, you'd know if you need, well, if it needs a surgical thing, you'd know. Could we pop it? No. Oh. I don't think it's that type. if they wanted to end. I don't think it's that type of uh, Dude, swap. Matt with one leg would be so good, man. <laughs> what would you, holy shit. <laughs> what, what would you do oh. with me? Dude, I, I'd, oh I'd really God. encourage you to embrace it. Yeah. Well, I'd have to. Yeah. Oh, you yeah, get to dude. learn how to be, to walk on one of those robot legs. Be the best. Those ones like <laughs> yeah, you and, could go on the Paralympics. And might think have a about chance. how strong your leg would get. You just l huge hops everywhere you go. <laughs> I reckon you'd have to always have a crutch, so you'd never use. Well, a I don't know. I've just... seen some of the guys with one legs. They do pretty well. I reckon you become a sour, bitter man who <laughs> oh. sits at home living off disability. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, <laughs> we're laughing. At, at least you could be fully into like Fortnite or gaming. <laughs> No, I don't know. I think you'd. Uh, I think Worms. you guys wouldn't let me do that. You'd encourage me. Yeah, James wouldn't let me do that. Um, fuck me. We had a bloody wild weekend. Just before we continue, last week's episode. So we we were scared of this. You know how all our episodes have been getting age restricted. Well, we're like, you know what? Let's 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 appeal one oh, no. and see what happens. Let's just see what fucking happens. See if they at least tell us why our videos are getting age restricted. Appealed it. Denied the appeal, and now we've scheduled the new podcast. It's due to come out in two hours, and it's already age restricted. So we we've never had a podcast get age restricted before it's been posted before. So it did do what we were feared it would do. It did more damage than than good, and now every fucking episode is getting age restricted. So we're gonna have to figure something out. We, we've lucky we've we've got a YouTube like a Google representative now that we can go to and talk to. But again. I don't know which one of our podcasts to show to them to sit down and so they can have a look without them thinking these cunts are so fucked. <laughs> so, so yeah, we've shot ourselves in the foot there. But yeah, what are our options? So this Google woman, we're just going to go to her and, and I'm just, I'm just going to sit her down and just be like, look, we just want to know why they're getting age restricted. Don't care about demonetized, just age restricted. And then we'll have to just stop that and then hopefully... We'll be okay. But we'll figure it out, boys. We'll just keep fucking trucking, trucking ahead. But you may need to turn on post notifications. I don't even know if that works. You, you need to be signed into YouTube and you might need to search for us, Marty and Michael, fully actual, um, to actually see the episodes because they're age restricted and they will not be recommended to you. Tell your friends, tell your family, five star review on Spotify. Spotify, everything's all good. So you got people on Spotify, keep those five star reviews fucking cut flying in, cunt, and like. Take this time to like and comment and subscribe if you haven't, because we are getting age restricted to the shit and fuck house, cunt. Next step is strikes, and then boom, channel's gone, and Matt's fucked. Do you really want Matt to get fucked? His life will be fucking over if this podcast is done. There's nothing else going on. Do you really want to live with that on your conscience? Like, comment, subscribe. Save Matt's fucking life. Look at him. It's getting worse. Now let's talk about our weekends, cunt. Hmm. All right. Michael, <clears throat> you got... Do you want me to go first? Yeah, because yeah, I. Go. it's exciting. 
I got another hole in one. Holy shit. Yeah. That's my third hole in one. It's pitch and putt. It's not real golf, yeah, but still it's, it's good. It's a shame that it's pitch and putt. And it's a shame that James wasn't there to see it either. Yeah. Michael what could be lying this whole time. Yeah. Oh, well, I, I kicked guess his ass in the first can, round. You well, can ask the guy that works there. One. Yeah, okay. All right. You know, yeah, that, I, you know that I won't. You know that yeah, I won't. I know. Yeah, but I, well, next time we're there, you can be like, did he get... Yeah. <laughs> you had witnesses for the first two though, right? First two I've had witnesses. Last one I didn't. I turned back to see these like these two couples playing and I was going to say something, but I didn't want to be that guy. <laughs> oh, that would have been so gross. And I was did so, you guys see that? I was so close as I was like, like handing... um. Like uh, I was putting some rubbish away and then I talked to the dude as I was leaving and he fucking goes, oh, how was it? And I was like, oh, I could say I got another hole in one, but I didn't want to be that guy. You should, <laughs> what? You should have at least said that. Yeah, that if that he asked you how okay. it goes. Yeah. yeah, well, he didn't even ask how it go. I just wanted to say that. Yeah, yeah, that's that's fun, but getting a random couple's attention yeah. and screaming it at him, that's obnoxious. Sprinting 100 yeah. metres. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see it? Did you see it? Yeah, no, I couldn't do that. But I looked around like a loser. Like I was like, oh, oh, oh. Damn it, I should have stayed. I would have loved to watch that. So you did a second round after James left. I played two balls and yeah, around twice. Does it like... Did that one hit the flag and then go in or did it just trickle Dude, and drop? it was a 60 degree perfect, just drop. Slam and dunk. It oh. rolled in after like two meters. Oh, it was tasty. so hot. That's the taste perfect kind. Oh. Taste anyway. Who won the actual James? James. Between you and James. James. Dude, is that why you did so it so well? No, I, I like fire. to play by myself as well. Like have a round after. It's like meditation. You're diversing yourself. Sort of, do you know what I mean? As long as you're improving yourself every day, that's the right direction to head in. Do you know what I mean? exactly Matt? it. I play a green ball and a red ball. And it's just, yeah, great time. I compete against each other. Oh, man. Me and Mon had such a nice, chilled weekend. We had a fire. And then, you know how I love just burning shit? Mon's kind of gotten into it too. So we just started burning random household items that we didn't need anymore. And we threw a blanket on the fire. And then so that good. burning of the blanket, the smell, like, oh, we were, we were both like had a bit of weed as well. So I was pretty high. That smell unlocked a memory I was like well, where do I recognize that smell from and then I boom shot back to fucking four year old Marty when my blanket slipped off of me in the middle of the night onto the heater and the blanket caught fire and mum ran in right before I Die. fucking died right before the, the <laughs> blanket caught fire and threw it in the middle in into the corner of the room that <gasps> that smell reminded me of that wow so same totally went back to it yeah wasn't you that trauma from that yeah, isn't right. it that night that somehow your mum just yeah. randomly mom said, woke up mom, she couldn't two smell in the morning, oh, two in the morning shit. this huge house like fucking wh bigger than the brownery and w opposite ends of the house 2am mum just randomly wakes up Walks to my room, and as she walks into my room, my the blanket on the on top of the heater bursts into flames. Did she yell oh. something in German? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that means, are you okay? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then, and then uh, yeah. So, man, me and Mon just had a real chill one, and just fucking ate good food, and just yeah, it was just so nice to just do nothing, man. I yeah. fucking love that shit. Bosley Works. nearly murdered a possum. That was fun yeah, to watch. Yeah, Bosley's fucking the possum saga continues. I I, I realized that we're just working so hard now, so that we can just. Go to bed later on in our lives. <laughs> I realize that with Mon. I realize that with Mon. I realize with Mon, like, all I want is just to be able to go to bed without a, a care in the world. Like, you know, sell whatever we've built in 10 years' time and then just go to bed without a fucking care in the world. <laughs> you also get to work with all your friends because of what you yeah, guys have built. Yeah, 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 exactly, obviously. So there is some positive. Yeah, yeah, it's just, it's just so relentless sometimes, you know, but yeah. fuck. Yeah, the body took a toll too. Yeah, yeah, we got fucking smashed up last fucking week, cunt. We filmed some banger fucking website vids, you fucking dumb cunt, cunt. Oh. And we had a fucking website video come out where we found a fucking fugitive in an abandoned house. Literally, I'm not even what making this up. What are the chances? Up. We find a fucking criminal in one of these abandoned mansions. Really? Didn't know he was a criminal, yeah. The cops were called, not by us, they just arrived while we were still in there. And then they're like, oh, there's a guy in there who's wanted. And then all of the, like five cop cars sh shop showed up and Did fucking you see took him? him out. You yeah. see, as, as soon as he pops into camera on like, cause I had my camera in front of my chest as I was just walking through rooms yeah. and you see him sort of sneakily put his head around. Oh, you see his look. shadow first, it's creepy oh. as fuck. Yeah. And then he's like, oh, can you, uh, oh man. He was like, oh, I'm it. just reading you gotta watch shit. It. He was acting cool, <laughs> like nothing was creep. wrong. But it was real creepy. Yeah, it yeah, felt like you didn't want to turn your back to him. You got that kind of vibe, like you couldn't trust him. What do you look like? Just like a normal dude. 
Really? Oh, yeah. I don't know. You yeah, have to watch creep. it to see it. It was very, very interesting. But anyway, yeah. That's you guys bought a coffee machine. Yeah, we bought oh, a coffee yeah, machine. Yeah. So we stopped spending fucking $30 a day on fucking coffee. Oh, Talk. you know what I did on the weekend that was pretty fucking cool? Yeah. I took one of the drones that we have now oh, yeah. and I went to Mount Gravatt oh. to the abandoned student village and flew it in there and like looked around and shit. Oh, oh the, wow. Is there a little robot eyes? Oh, I was just dude, standing in the sun idea. getting some wow. sunshine and then I'm like flying this thing and just looking at this abandoned village. You can tell it you get cool. addicted to it, especially with those virtual reality glasses that that, that, that oh, drone pilot yeah. was. Yeah. again? Trent. Yeah, Trent. Trent. Yeah. That, that the trend had on. Imagine that you just with the you just fucking fly around. You can like look at things. It's just yeah, it was epic. Very cool. And then I just made a shitload of weed oil. Yeah, yeah. nice. <laughs> I made drugs. I can't wait to fucking try. <laughs> yeah, something. it's out of all my old vape stuff. So I was saying to Michael, it's, it's like recycling. Yeah, it is. And you it's get to get high THC. Yeah. It's the best. So you smoke it originally, then you use your vaped weed. Yeah, like it, it has to, to be cook. vaped. You can't have it in a bong because obviously it, it's gone. Yeah, Matt. So yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Matt looks like he's been sucked through a bong with what, what he's fucking wearing right now. What are you? Uh, <laughs> I guess it's up to you now. What what happened on your weekend? Uh, let's hear it, man. What well, I didn't fucking shit. Here well, we three go. things happened that were cool. Uh, one was shit. Sorry, two were cool. One was shit. Um, one was knee, which we've covered. The other one was. I won a Worms tournament. Oh, God. The only reason he won is because <laughs> me and Ryan had to gang up on each other. Worms is It was a three-way game. Hey, man, you play your strategies. I visualized it. I saw it. I did it. And I won. He did win by half a point. Half a point? <laughs> I'm all right with it. A win's a win. Yeah, and- I know, did betray Ryan really badly to get a win. But, um, <laughs> Again, that's fine. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's, just, it you was, ain't cheating. You ain't trying. But we had such a good time because my knee was- blown out i couldn't do anything it was so good that everyone came over to play worms otherwise i don't know what i would have done could have I been think cool. you would have hung out with me and kk or listen to that was the come? original plan yeah Do you, i don't know if i it may be a problem i think you would have listened to music and just kind of like be leaning out the window having <laughs> cigarettes and shit singing to yourself and just kind of <laughs> bopping around that's what i reckon you would have done <laughs> toto africa i picture that <laughs> listen to that song <laughs> smoking <laughs> cigarettes inside and um, and then the third thing was um, <laughs> with one of the wigs on, with that wig on, yeah. <laughs> oh, I picture that. Oh. What else happened? Um, and then yeah, the third thing was um, is uh, I got some mail. Oh shit! Oh, I got some mail. I got sake. some mail. I got some mail. Our friend, which um, is Marty's old roommate, Dave, sent you guys some mail. Oh, did he? Well, I believe he did. And um, yeah, you unwrapped it already. Yeah, you've already opened it. Oh, that's right. What Tom Green, it? Tom Green DVDs. Ah, oh, that's right. I texted good. him a thank you video from you boys. Yeah. So. yeah. But this lovely, lovely man is a is a friend of our who, and he's an artist. Um, Mayer, uh, John, John Mayer. Him? Yeah, him. Yeah, but we call him Dave. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's what you're talking about. Yeah. And Dave. Um, <laughs> John, John Mayer. John Mayer. He is an artist. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Dave has um, realized I have this newfound, you know, um, obsession hobby of stickers. Oh, no. And Dave sent me a sticker. If it's going to be a sticker that's good, it'd be from Dave. So this yeah, will probably be the probably best be sticker, the that you've sticker that you've ever had. I've you can't it. find it. it. He's shuffling around his wheelchair. <laughs> He's lost his sticker. Oh, that's my sticker. Oh, Brad, you go on about the sticker. You got to have <laughs> no, the sticker. Maybe it's at the Fucking doctor's. Fucking hell! Little, of course you do I that. Wipe it. A thing I had him on. Wow, this is gone. No. Well, maybe that's it's it. here. Maybe it's in my hand. <laughs> <laughs> it's in my hand all along. Oh, oh Marty! I'm breaking. I had it right. I had it right. I had it right. He stood up and his his knee just bucked just wore out. He bursted. All the fluid came out. <laughs> like he'd stood on a landmine. His leg just explodes <laughs> off him. It would just add to all the bullying Marty's done to me. <laughs> as soon as Matt told Marty that he hurt his knee. Marty's pissed himself <laughs> laughing at him for like 10 minutes. Well, it's not a serious <laughs> injury, you know. It's not. It's a light-hearted injury and it, and it adds to Matt. The, he's yeah. limp, limping around with it. It is quite oh, sour. So sour this looking is my on his sticker. face. I, I'm not sure. Did Dave draw that? Probably, yeah. He probably did, dude. Yeah, wow. what, did he send you a note on it? No, no. I've been writing notes on the back of it. Um, what have you said? What were the notes you wrote on the yeah, back? Read them out loud. Oh, just my weekend. So, what's so. the sticker say? What's just the meaning behind it? Yourself. Nothing. It's just a cool drawing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, your work. It. It's a bit <laughs> psychedelic. <laughs> 
That's the best sticker mm. you've got so far. Yeah, yeah. Michael actually. Yeah, oh, Dave, dude, is, oh. Dave is spot on again. Fuck, I thought you fucked the sticking part. It really hurt my OCD, but you're all right. <coughs> all right, well, there the you go. One. Pikachu needs to go, man. Yeah, it's too fucked. Listen, mate. Even the Stormtrooper. No, if I could sit on that couch right there and, and judge you right now, I would. There's <laughs> yeah. no space. Um, um, also, this week we're going, we're camping. We're fucking, oh, we're yes. heading out this Thursday night. We got Jackson and Lockie coming. We got the Cracker Milk Boys coming. We're Lukey's going, coming with a four wheel drive. Yeah, we are fucking going to the mountains and we're going to do a, a camping trip and, and just film some videos that we, it's all started with we needed a location to film this one website video and now it's evolved into this fucking camping trip and boy oh boy are we excited. It's going to be fun. It's yeah. it's going to be a bit of mayhem, though. Um, and no showers, by by the way, boys. Yeah, yeah. So well, You can swim in the fine. dam, but I saw a water rat in there once, and they are pretty big. I'm so, down with that. Yeah, they're massive. They're like this big, but that, well, that's their body and tail. Well, wow. Uh, Luke will be there, though, right? Yeah, Luke will protect us yeah, from all. So. Yeah. All is well. Luke will be <clears> there. And we saw that thing in the water, that little weird... Yeah, that was it, the water rat. No, we, remember we saw another little thing kept popping up in the water. Oh, the little leechy We didn't know what that was. Yeah. Dad reckons oh. it's a baby eel. Oh, yeah. Yuck. Oh, yucky, yucky. It looked like a long, like, you, you know, like the ringworm. That would oh. a real one, but like long and swimmy. Yucky. Yeah, feral. Oh, that's so fucking <laughs> gross. Anyway, have a swim in there. But yeah, so there probably will be, I'm going to try and get a lot of sleep on Wednesday night because I doubt there'll be any to, to very little sleep on Thursday night. Hey, Brown. You should just guarantee yourself a bed. Yeah, just, I'll just try. Just shotgun one. Say shotgun real quick. Shotgun. There you go. Shotgun two. Sh yeah, yeah. You can have that <clears throat> if you come. I'm just going to get earplugs and an eye mask and make sure that the blanket is fucking warm this time. You yeah. Fucking what the fuck, man. Yeah, blanket. S man. Maybe sleep in the Michael car Wood. again. <laughs> Sheets oh, for us. Nah. Yeah, that was my. Yeah, I can't sleep in cars. Yeah, it was painful that. sleeping in the car last time. <laughs> now you're in a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> But anyway, that's our fucking weekend. Let's fucking get in or get into some fucking sponsors, you cunt. Ew. Mm. Mm. AG1. Huh. We all here take AG1 because it's got 75 vital nutrients and minerals in it. In it. it is actually very healthy and good for you and it fucking makes us feel better and you have a huge burst of energy straight after. That's no joke. That is 100% the truth. It's a monthly subscription. It shows up on your door. You put the powder in the cup and you drink it. It's fucking delicious and it's all, it's, it's vegan, it's dairy free, it's GMO free, it's made in the most healthiest ways possible it genuinely helps fucking boost your shit cunt I fucking been on it and done blood tests and shit and the doctors fucking looked at me and said cunt these results are fucking shit fucking awesome cunt and I fucking turned around and flexed to that bitch and said yeah cunt and that's all cause AG1 so go to AG1 slash fully actual and you get a free travel pack and you can slurp the shit down or you fucking a prostitute on a plane you dirty pricks it, it's also green. Yeah, it's very green. Yeah. That's well done, Michael. Yeah, well done. Your <laughs> colours are getting so much better, dude. Thank you. Anyway, AG one. Link in the description. Outsource that part of your your health. Get into the habit now, and you'll thank us in fucking ten years' time. Trust me. If fucking twenty three year old Marty was here, I'd put my thumb straight into his fucking eyes and squish him like back into his fucking brain and scream at him to get onto some AG one. Come. How would you scream at him? <laughs> You won. Yeah, that would work. Michael, no, 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 Michael, stop. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, don't that do that. That would be so painful. Yeah, yeah, with my eyes open too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and then like really sharp thumbnails so it <laughs> splits the ball as you push it in. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that is rough. <laughs> Imagine going like oh, that, dude. Put your put your thumbs on your open eyes and push in a bit. We should dude, do that as a video. That? Marty has his thumbs on Michael's eyes, and Michael has oh, his thumbs on Marty. Oh, and just both push in. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, stop pushing your yeah, eyes. You can push yeah. your eyes. No, do it. No, yeah, already you can do it. swollen. You can, stop it. You can do it with a closed eye, dude. You're gonna lose your eyesight. Try it. No. Okay. How much? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll give okay. you. $30 to try. I don't mind pushing them on like that, but I'm not doing It's got to be open eye and then I'll put your thumb on your eye and push in. No. <laughs> AG1. <laughs> okay. And man, scape. You're wasting your potential, you know. <laughs> You're unhappy. You feel like shit. You look like shit. 
and it's time for change. Change only happens one small step at a time. Still I'm thinking, oh, I've got to fucking lose 30 kilos. There's no way I'm going to be able to... Just make the first step. And the first step is to care. And the best way to care is to go to manscaped.com and use our discount code FULLYACTUAL20 to get 20% of all of their male grooming products. And some female grooming shit too, cunt. Holy shit, they got some shit to make you fucking so happy. They got fucking nose hair trimmer. Not to mention their lawnmower 4.0. It's fucking insane. And you can use it in the shower so you can snip your... Well, your, your, your fucking prostitutes arrived early. You can jump in the shower and shave your cock at the same time and fucking get in there and, and then use the ball wipes on your nuts and then go outside and wipe your mother's face with it and have a chuckle to yourself. And it's all healthy. It's all fine. Go out and fuck a prostitute go and fuck a prostitute manscaped.com go and fuck a prostitute how fu- fucking 70 year old prostitute manscaped.com and fuck her as hard as you can with our discount code fully actual 20 and just fucking slam her in a fucking motel room with your fucking family at home fucking manscaped.com now, get, get, your, get your grooming shit from there you brother it's fucking good shit cunt why are we age restricted? Yeah, why, why are we age restricted? <laughs> also for women. <laughs> the hairy your ones. Family at home was my favourite bit. <laughs> oh, okay. Very, oh, very. Uh, anyway, very, very, yeah, yeah. Discount code. Go to manscaped.com slash fully extra 20, 20% off. It's fucking good shit. I'll tell you what right now, brother. <laughs> You still do nick your balls sometimes. So you still have to be careful. I'm not saying don't be careful. I'm saying it's much less likely that you're going to. Matt? Sorry. And, of course, our University of Michael, our uh, subscription <coughs> website where we post weekly content. Um, it's our fucking favorite. <laughs> well, uh, we've confirmed we've signed two new content creators. Um, hopefully their content will be start coming out in maybe like a month or something. So there'll be more content creators other than us. You pay the same amount and you get like three videos a week instead of one. And ours is the best. Ours is so fun. How much fun is ours? We're actually getting high oh hiking God. part two. Michael, this, this you oh, have yeah. to show them your fucking bruise. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. dude! Yourself, you have to brother. show them. This is the most. We filmed a website video last week, and Michael's probably got the worst bruise I think that we've ever had oh. in our Marty. Connor, Michael can we get career. some dramatic reveal music? Or Marty? Imagine it was just his bare ass. Look and at that! And this happened by chance. Marty hit him in the same spot three times with squash it? ball. Yeah, it was an accident. Full ball. Oh. Oh, it's much bigger than Look I thought. At that. Yeah, yeah, dude. It's but you, yeah, you need to. Um, you might need to part your legs a bit more because you can't see that it's all the way round. Yeah, it's like on the inside of the thigh. Pull Connie, on it you, a bit. Connie, can you get in on that? That's oh. fucking. Yeah, Look that's it. it. Look that's at that. It. Look yeah, at that's that. It. That's not okay. So also, we, found- Michael, before you sit down, just smell this. I want to know what you think of it. I had a band aid on it for two days. It smells weird. <laughs> what do you think of that? <laughs> oh, wow. It's on a white. Look at that. <laughs> oh, I, I wouldn't advise on that. Anyway, 260 videos on the site. 21 day free trial. Have a fucking geese and see what you reckon. There's fucking fucking comments and shit now. You can fucking. It's just a good time, Matt. I got bashed by a professional MMA fighter last week. Oh, that's Adrian right. Pace. That was hard to watch. It was actually oh, really interesting. And. The other video that we filmed last week is going to be a oh, yeah, banger. Yeah. Julian we- has been saying that he has struggled to edit it because he's pissing himself laughing so hard. Yeah, that's yeah, it's always that, a good sign. Good Was sign. this the one I walked in on? Yeah. Okay, yeah. The cocktail one. I didn't think that 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 would be that good, but um, how see. did Adrian Pang take it easy or was he no. brutal? I saw or? the footage. Oh, oh, he, look, he could have anything. he could have easily gone way harder. Yeah, yeah. He said he went at seventy percent, but some of those punches were not seventy percent. He put but it. He the leg kicks. His hip. The leg yeah. kicks were the first oh. ones. Just straight away, I, I had my hands up. Just leg kick and then leg kick again, and then the second leg kick was where it was just like I can't. I oh can't do that. yuck! So wow. I, I had to put my hands down to cover that part and just risk getting knocked out. That must be what. Fuck, that's man. what fighters go through. They take a couple hits to the leg and that's it they're not yeah, done yeah, it's yeah oh. they're fighters yeah like wow. they're used to leg kicks <laughs> yeah man anyway so that's the fucking sponsors you fucking prick see <laughs> what's his gym called again Jack- integrated Klali. MMA integrated MMA <laughs> Go check it's them a very out. good gym. Yeah. It's not <laughs> Jaklalu. Integrated. <laughs> no, but they thought about Jaklalu. <laughs> they went, they with, went with integrated, integrated MMA. 
It's a um, bit more memorable <laughs> and easier to spell too. Tuvalu <laughs> has, some, has a lot of vowels in it. <laughs> yeah. Michael, <laughs> would you like a questions dance? Oh, yes. Uh, <laughs> this isn't Q&A. We're just going to do the dance for it because these boys just absolutely love it. Are you ready? You have all the questions and we have all the answers and we've got lots of dances for you. Anyway, let's have our first bong break and we'll be right back with Matt vs. Michael Khan. <laughs> And we're back. Um, I wonder how. Oh, this episode that's coming out today, everyone's going to DM Emu Rock and see if we can get Henry on board. Oh yes. We're in the midst of. We've started planning Michael's bucks, so that's that's fucking. It's going to be a fucking another f- couple of loose nights there. Maybe we just fire up the podcast when he's here piss as fuck and oh, just dude. go for yeah, it yeah, oh, if it's up to Mike or oh, we'll dude, see how we feel I think I'm I'd be careful yeah I really want like <clears throat> a lot of plastic shit like tables to like smash on that'd be fine yeah okay so plastic tables and chairs lots of them yeah, yeah. lots and lots and lots of them <laughs> I would love Michael to do a cannonball onto a plastic <laughs> chair it probably will <laughs> happen dude I reckon by like <laughs> Seven o'clock sat on the Saturday AM. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're getting seven PM. That's when that will occur. Should we just fill the entire house with plastic stuff? No, just a couple of tables. No. I just want to snap a few. Whole thing. All Sorry. right, guys. Matt, hit it. Which one? Matt vs. Michael. Oh, so excited. Matt vs. Michael, it's Matt vs. Michael, it's Matt vs. Michael today. Matt vs. Michael, it's Matt vs. Michael, it's Matt vs. Michael today. Yay! Come, come, come have fun. Come, 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 oh, ooh, what's the come? Come have fun, come have fun, come have fun today. Bottle of cum. <laughs> All right, so it's, um, it's 13 to 10. Fuck, I don't know. Brain's gone. It is. That's I think hot, it is. Man. It's 13 to 10. Matt's coming so. home We strong. can check. Um, you won last week, right? I think so. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we had the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's right. Yeah, you're Maybe. double digits now. All right, now, everyone knows what they're playing for, all right? The secret bottle of mints which sits here above us and looks down on us and protects us at night from the evil spirits. So it is a sacred, beautiful bottle. It's valuable. You could go to a sperm bank and sell that for fucking hundreds of dollars, cunt. Anyway. Millions. 13 to 10 to Michael. Whoever wins overall at the end of the season gets to fucking keep it. And that's like... That's special. Yeah. Anyway, today's competition is... Who is better... At beatboxing... I didn't know. No, I didn't know. But I did suggest this. Yeah, Michael did suggest Fuck. this one. I don't, I'm not even good at it. Yeah, right. Neither am I. I don't even think what I'm going to do. That's good. That's music to my fucking ears, first. guns. All right. How long do we have to do it? 30 seconds. And you Holy have to try and keep fuck. going for 30 seconds. Oh, do you want me to get a timer going? Oh, oh, oh you got one? Yeah. <clears throat> All right. So oh, paper, that's scissors, a long scissors. beatbox. Yeah. That's really going to test test them. <laughs> Your lips are going to get really sore. Scissors, paper, rock, see you guys first. I've got... Fucking one beat and that's it. Scissors, paper, rock. Scissors, paper, rock. Fuck! Oh, Can I say okay. something before this begins? Because I know there's a hack. And if they do the hack for the whole time, they're not allowed. It, it, it's, a, it's instant loss. I don't know what the hack the is. The hack is just to say boots and cats over and over. Like boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats. Oh, it yeah, sounds like yeah. beatboxing. Thank you. Oh, yeah. What about purple Loops. pizza, purple pizza? You yeah, can't say words. If it's just that the whole time, then that will win. <laughs> well, you know, you, 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 but you're judged on your creativity. Okay, yeah, so yeah, if yeah. you do that for the whole time, you, you, there's a high chance you will lose. Oh, it's going to be so shit. All right, Matt, who do you want to go first? I might go first. I always go All right, first. Michael. <clears throat> I'll count you in. All right, mm. on three. A one. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Let me breathe. A one, two, three. <laughs> Time! 
very good. Very. Oh. It was good, but it's also it's a cover. Like you know, it's uh, there is an existing. Yeah. It's a remix of a cover. Yeah, the rhythm was good. There was some, I liked the songy bit because it was good singing. But yeah, creativity wise, it's it's a it's a pass. Yeah. Just okay. all right, well, we'll give our final scores at the Matt end. Can but beat it with creativity. <sighs> all right, <clears throat> all right, here we go, man. I'll count you in. I am nervous. A one, a two, a one, two, three, go. <laughs> Time. Man, that was exhausting. (laughs) How do people do that? Yeah. I'm oh, not yeah, even making any. Were look, way better than I thought you'd both yeah, look, be. To be Matt, honest, Matt's like beats were way out of time, and like he was. There was I was just trying to go for creativity. Yeah, 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 but yeah, Matt's create. Matt's was very unique and original. So fuck. All right. Um, Are you giving them each a score out of ten? And yes. then we add the scores. Yeah, up. yeah, okay. exactly. And I'm and I'm doing one point decimals as well, so you can be like a one point three. <laughs> oh, that's such a low score. <laughs> out of ten. Out of ten. Hang on, what's the, also on the on the rubric of beatboxing, are we putting like Joel Turner as a ten? Yeah, I, yeah. Is he exactly. Okay, so don't feel bad if you get below like five. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. Um. Yeah. Yeah. This is like this is like comparing to professional <laughs> beatboxers. Yeah, but zero is like a rock. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. So um, I gave. Um, Michael, a um, four point six. Wow, oh, that's strong. I was going to say a five point five. Right. Okay, so that's a a ten point one. What did I say? Four point six. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ten point one. It's not bad. <clears throat> and I gave Matt a, uh, a a flat five. Oh shit. I gave Matt a six point five. Okay. Oh, so the creativity was great. I was just praying. A yeah, little I like the five bits in it. Okay. <laughs> All right. So thirteen eleven. Wow. Thirteen eleven. Matt the is coming is back. climbing back. The beatbox gods just look. You know what's funny? Shit. When you've tried, the win ratio is way higher than mine. I can't believe you brought it back. Yeah, see, you just never give up. Behind. You laughed for a split second there. I know, I nearly like, lost it too. But it, it sounded tried. like you did it on purpose nearly. Wow. <laughs> it was yeah. in time. I was going to take marks off, but then he restarted so quickly that it almost yeah. made me give more marks. Past Matt would have been like, oh, no, I laughed. Okay. Oh, that's it. Yeah, I give up. I get that. Yeah. You'd be like, oh, shit, I fucked that up. Yeah. yeah. Um, but you you persevered and you overtook him in the end. Do you it's like, just like the tortoise and the hare. Do you remember? You did um, say that shit too. Yeah, I said you were acting like that. <laughs> I'm still um, confident. <laughs> um, did you remember at school where people would try and battle each other? Did you ever have any of those people? No, at the man, I didn't go to that kind of school. Oh, man. Fucking sick cunt. That's <laughs> fucked. We break have, dancing, that would happen. Yeah, we had break like dancing too. Yeah. Really? Yuck. Yeah. What, the guys at your school? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. At, like yeah. school socials, that yeah, shit yeah. happened. Oh, yeah, but uh, really? Maybe. Oh, actually, yeah, I do remember that. Oh, never Fucking at school. Josh Only dances and, and shit used to oh, okay. be real into that. That's right. Yeah, it did happen at parties. I, Not at school, but yeah. at parties. Yeah. I remember like a specific event at my school where there was this dude came to our school. He was new and he was like a semi-professional beatboxer. And this dude showed up at our school during lunchtime, didn't go to our school and, and was like, I want to battle him. And like all these crowds came and it was just crazy. What and they had the this fuck? battle over the fence at each other. Yeah, I think and that's then, very like yeah, it was Palm disgusting. Beach. It's very Palm Beach. Dude. Yeah. Oh, oh man. man. That was hard to hear. Did you bash him? That's, that hat How Matt's wearing is actually part of his old school uniform from Palm Beach. <laughs> so are the gloves. And so it are is the actually shorts. Gold Coast. So are the shorts of schools <laughs> sponsored by this Forex. PE uniform. <laughs> <laughs> the MMA gloves. Because <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, it's man. constantly biffo. At the school. <laughs> All right, everyone, we're going to move right along to Matt's Tinder oh, adventures. Hit it, Matt. T I N D R, we have Matt's Tinder. <laughs> Matthew Brown has lost control. Now these women will lose their souls. Mm. 
All right, now this is a segment where we have taken over Matt's Tinder, used all his photos, all his personal information, used his full fucking name, everything out there, and we speak to these girls <laughs> as if Matt were talking to them. So these women believe, truly believe, it's Matthew Gregory Brown on the other end having a conversation, saying these fucking things, and we're helping him fuck things. We want you to fuck things, cunt. Yeah. Put your cock up at <sighs> that, that, and that, and that. Done. Our job's done. We just want Age your sperm all over Brisbane, cunt. Um, and that's what I'm trying here. Yeah. Are you still actually trying to find me someone? Hey, haven't you been listening to the for the last fucking however many episodes? Yes, I'm trying to find you someone, Matt. Things have been happening, dude. Mm-hmm. It's going... I reckon you'll have a wife within weeks. All right, guys. Yes. But... Petrally, I mean, sec- s- technically, it's working, sort of. Petrally. Well, yeah, there have been some. Petrally. Yeah. You've added some fuel to the fire. <laughs> yeah, exactly right. <laughs> That's for Kleiner. All right, all right. All right, here we fucking go, everyone. Fucking strap yourselves in because I was, I had my phone on me. Like, I would just do this like an hour Lunch a breaks. night, you know? So some of these conversations. Yes, you've have been developed. slack. Just. Yeah, yeah, I have. Get I have it. been slapped. But this is recently. like now that there's like full on stories. Now, yeah, yeah, like- I've got, I've got, I reckon enough conversations for like two or three weeks here. But anyway, here we go. <clears throat> so she starts the conversation. <clears throat> Hello, how are you? Fucked. Just scraped this huge scab I had on my back off. Stinks so bad. <laughs> How's your weekend and shit? Oh, what happened? I work during weekends and I have this eczema in my hand for a month now. It's so annoying. I'm so sick of this. I was riding my granddad's cow and my foot got caught in the saddle. It fully dragged me across the car park gravel. I was twisting and squirming trying to get out of it. (laughs) It hurts so bad. Oh, that's hectic. How come you got that? And what do you do on weekends? Oh, I bet it's so painful. I work as a chef. That's why I work during weekends. How about you? What do you do? Yeah, it was so unlucky. Worst part is my granddad told me not to ride the cow and that they're different to horses, but I fully got in his face and got like heaps aggressive with him. <laughs> he bitched out and let me do it, but I guess I should have listened. <laughs> Lesson learned. Oh, that's sick as hectic shit. Do you work at a super fancy restaurant? I love food. I eat pretty much like every day. What do you like to cook? I like salty ears, pigs, slow cooked and then dried out. My old roommate showed me and he used to live in one of them weird countries. <laughs> Ha <laughs> 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 ha you naughty No one ride the cow <laughs> Lesson learned now that you listen I work in community clubs So not a fancy restaurant <laughs> But way back on my hometown I used to work in a fancy restaurant though It was f- and fun But now just chilling I also like food I like cooking at home I cooked what's in the fridge <laughs> I usually cook like western or Filipino food What do you do? <laughs> yeah, my granddad is still pretty upset with me. <laughs> More because I got right up in his face and was like yelling at him a little bit. Oh, that's so hectic as shit. Knowing how to cook food is such a slippery skill to have in your back pocket. I'm currently in between jobs and just enjoying some time to myself. Work well, gets so hectic sometimes, so I decided that I wasn't going to work this year and just chill. <laughs> it's been so nice just doing absolutely nothing but watching TV and gaming mostly. Last year when I had a job, I was a council worker and doing labouring and standing around holding street signs and shit. <laughs> oh, I feel so pity for your granddad. Just be careful next time. I really love cooking. It's my passion, especially when I cook for my family and friends. <clears throat> Enjoy what you have right now. You deserve it. Every second of it. Uh, yeah. He's just really opinionated. Oh. <clears throat> he's just really opinionated sometimes and always tries to tell me what to do. I love my granddad, but like, yeah, I just want him to fuck up sometimes, you know? <laughs> he's so old and doesn't know shit anymore, apart from the cow. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm thinking. To be honest, it's a pretty easy living off Centrelink payments. I might write a book or some shit. Grandparents always are like that. Just be patient to them. Oh, wow, that's so cool. At least you have something to do that you love. Yeah, okay, I'll try to be more patient. As long as he doesn't try and tell me to stop eating Maccas every now and then, that shit really pisses me off. What would that old fuck know about Woody? Probably ate, like, fucking wooden shit back a hundred years ago. <laughs> so what are your dreams and shit like that? She's what a re- chef. <laughs> What restaurant? He probably ate wood. What <laughs> restaurant you work at? Is it actually called Community Club? <laughs> oh, don't say that. 
You were too hush to say that to say that your granddad he just oh. wants you to eat something healthy. Macca's is not good if you eat like every day. I grew up with my grandparents and yes, they are hard sometimes, but it's for our own good though. I love them and I cherish every moment when I was in my hometown. I work in a cafe. Yeah, my granddad's just a little bit too annoying. Always nagging at me. Don't eat macas. Don't ride cows. Don't scream at me. Blah, blah, blah. I'm a grown man and I can make my own decisions. What cafe are you at? I might come in wearing a dress and embarrass you. <laughs> can you imagine? <laughs> I won't tell you. Maybe you come to my workplace and embarrass me. <laughs> I would definitely do that. It would be so funny, though. I would wear a really tight pink dress and run in saying your name really loudly. <laughs> so what cafe is it? <laughs> nah, I will not say. Oh, why won't you? Just tell me. It will be funny. I've already got the dress, so it's kind of rude that you aren't telling me. <laughs> Don't you, like, get funny stuff or, or some shit? Everyone will piss themselves <laughs> laughing, I promise. So just tell me. I like funny stuff, but that thing, though, I don't like to be embarrassed. It won't be embarrassing, I promise. Everyone will think it's funny. Trust me. <laughs> Just try it. And if no one is laughing, I will leave. And then she stopped replying. But I, conti I continued. I'm starting to get really frustrated here. I told you I already have the dress. Why can't you just let me come to your cafe in it with lipstick on and scream your name a little bit? It's funny. <laughs> Again, ignored. It's just tell me if it's north side or south side at least. This is so weird that you aren't telling me. And then I sort of caved, caved a bit. <clears throat> Do you hate me now? Be, be honest. I've given the dress to my sister, and then she started replying again. Oh my god! Oh, you are so naughty. You hate me, don't you? Would you still consider getting to know me? No more dresses, I promise. I don't hate you. I just don't like the idea you will embarrass me. Yeah, but remember I said it's not embarrassing and it's more funny than embarrassing? I don't like it. Just respect that decision. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what my sister said I should do when I gave her the pink dress I bought. So how's your weekend? Are you okay? It seems like you are not. Life's been rough lately, not gonna lie. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear. Things will be okay soon. I bend down low and slowly move my body move my body around the kitchen. Mark my body with a thin knife. <laughs> oh, oh, I take a ladle and splash hot oil on my bare skin. I hear it sizzle and the blinding pain reminds me of my childhood. And that's an ongoing conversation. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, oh dude, man. That is run so a mile, that girl. Oh wow. Yeah, so they're all quite long. The but, patience um, she has to put up with that shit. Yeah, I know that dude. I realized doing this dinner segment, like, like at the end of the day, I feel kind of sad because I'm like, there are so many people out there who just have such low standards that they're willing to just like, like some of these are crazy. Like it gets a lot worse than this. <laughs> yes, here we go. And it's they're willing to just like look past just some really serious issues. Well, look at look at people who stay in bad relationships. Like they stick through some shit. Yeah. How com complimentary can I be without you unmatching me? I definitely won't be unmatching you. <laughs> How forward can I be without you unmatching me? <laughs> Let's find out. I want to meet you at my place and suck on your tits and front slip without even saying a word to you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You, you said this one last week. My compliment is lame compared to that opening line. Wait, this whole thing? Not this whole thing. You started this conversation already. Okay, so I know all right, this one. All right, so we really? started this. Yeah. I don't remember that. Oh, I remember Oh, actually, one. yeah. I remember telling you about this And you last told week. me after it. Anyway, um... Sorry. My compliment is lame compared to that opening line. I see you didn't unmatch me. <laughs> After I suck your front gap, I'd flip you over and drill a hole through you. <laughs> I already have three. While I'm pedantic about equal numbers, I really don't need a fourth. And I definitely won't be unmatching you. I want to be the reason you have that gorgeous smile on your face. <laughs> I'll work on the other holes first then, but my rules are simple. No talking, straight to business. Then I'll book your Uber home once we've both exploded. <laughs> oh. I live on oh, the Sunshine no. Coast. My night off isn't often and it's only a Saturday. So you decide if that fits in within your rules. Yeah, that's perfect. I'm just at work right now, but let's get the details later. <clears throat> Anyway, where were we? Keen to have your massive tits sucked raw. I want to slubber all over you and make weird sounds. So don't you ever travel to the female? Only if I can sprint to her house in under three kilometers. 
<laughs> That's fair. What other rules do you have? No talking. Only moaning. <laughs> must be showered. Must be punctual. And must do whatever I want. I've got a fucking bucket full of gravy with your name on it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Figuratively or literally? <laughs> I'm talking about the fucking bucket of full of gravy. <laughs> Figuratively or li- li- literally? No, I, I have a literal bucket of gravy. <laughs> I want to sit you in a bathtub and slop it all over you, oh. and then just let me do my thing. Oh, <laughs> you will have an immense amount of pleasure, but I will finish inside of you. Oh, oh my <laughs> god! god. She, unmatched. she unmatched. Oh yeah, my yep. god! Whew, that was hard. <sighs> Holy shit! So Matt starts a conversation. Pour sour milk down the drain, not in the bin. <laughs> Lesson learned today. <laughs> what? <laughs> I poured a two liter bottle of really off milk into the bin. Then a few hours later, I went to take the bins out and there was a hole in the bottom of the bin bag. So all the sour milk started pouring out with bin juice. I panicked and tried to sling the bag out of an open window near me, but missed and the bag exploded on the wall next to the window. My whole house smells of off milk and rotting breast tissue. <laughs> Sling it out a window? Yeah, I'm kind of glad it didn't make it through or it would have ended up in the neighbor's yard. <laughs> oh dear, I'm not sure what to think of you now, lol. <laughs> I guess I learned that I'm not good under pressure. <laughs> what would you have done? <laughs> <laughs> Put it down the sink in the first place and not the bin? <laughs> oh yeah, lesson learned. I couldn't be bothered cleaning it yet. My roommate is going to split her mouth open when she sees the mess. <laughs> oh gross! You haven't cleaned? She'll be kicking you out, lol. <clears throat> I was in a rush to an appointment, and when I got home, there was literally hundreds of flies. Then I thought, I'm kind of want to see my roommate's reaction. <laughs> I'm always heaps hectic and hard to live with, but it's funny, so that always makes up for it. <laughs> I'm just thankful I'm not your housemate, lol. <laughs> she came home and fully lost it. <laughs> She's fully gagging and shit. <laughs> oh my god, I filmed it. Right, can I have your number? I'll send it to you. She left for the night to stay to friends. <laughs> oh my god, so good. I'm not surprised. No, I'm good. I don't need to see it. Rumor just called me this morning and she's kicking me out. <laughs> Fucking hell, she can't even take a joke. <laughs> I'm definitely not cleaning this mess now. Hey, do you know any places for cheap rent, like 150 a week? <laughs> Oh, dude, imagine if she offered you a room somehow. And I got, and I signed all the paperwork under Matt's name and he was living in a lease for, in this woman's house. <laughs> oh, wow. That would be an extreme prank. Dude, prank so prank. we've just got you a, a potential Michael? roommate. No. Okay. <laughs> man, oh, there are so many here that I just want to read to you guys. Oh, Fuck. Fucking hell. Oh, man. Oh, there's some good ones, but I'll save them. I'll save them. Sorry. Anyway. <laughs> So, as you can see, some progress. We're developing relationships, um, uh, communication, kindness. Um, everyone's in love. Um, Matthew Gregory Brown progressing. Options. Lots of options. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Look, I just found this one. I just thought it was funny because this chick's uh, on her. She's like a professional fighter, like literally an MMA fighter. So she Matt, good looking? So, Matt opens with, I want you to bash me. That could be arranged. Oh, fuck yes. That's so cool. I've always wanted a super hard head kick from a chick just to get clean knocked out stiff. (laughs) (laughs) Next week? (laughs) She didn't reply for a while, so I replied a few days later. So did you have some spare time this week? I honestly don't want long. I just want to be severely (laughs) knocked out. A really clean connection to my skull with your shin. (laughs) Don't Um, write back yet. And then she unmatched. (laughs) Oh. Oh, God, stiff. <laughs> was she a pretty fighter? Yeah, not too bad. Very like muscly and like mm. strong. But you ruined it. Well, mm. arguably, I, okay. she won't forget you. <laughs> if she sees you, she'll try and knock she'll you out. Probably fucking knock me out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's really why I'm getting knocked out. Stiff. <laughs> <laughs> so much he wastes days and checks again. <laughs> like he's been thinking about it. <laughs> He's finally found someone who's willing to do it. She oh, thought he was joking. Stiff. First message. And then she realized he wasn't Papendo. joking. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Dude. Holy shit. Yeah. Holy fuck, man. That's very good. You burn the computer. It doesn't do that. Say but sorry. Like, sorry. <laughs> Matt, say sorry, Matt. Matt no, say sorry no. back. No. I won't. Okay, I won't do that ever again. <laughs> I look so I aggressive with his outfit. <laughs> no, fuck that. 
Oh, anyway, that's fucking fucking cunt. Should we do um, a fucking uh, lying segment or a screaming segment? What cunt? Oh, yeah, um, the fucking... Uh, we've changed locations one last time. We're going to the hinterlands now near you guys. You're a lying little dog. Fuck. <laughs> How did you know? Because I just assumed you're probably filming a podcast and trying to lie. Fuck, he's good, oh, man. Yeah, he's too good. He's too good. We're, that's what we're gonna, too good. We got to fucking call mates that, oh, that we don't like. I knew that I laughed at him. What do you want, cunt? <laughs> <laughs> that's how he answers yeah. the call to everyone. Can Jackson help us now oh, to, Jackson, to lie to someone else? Can we lie to Lockie about something? What's something that we he sh- we should know? Correct me if I'm wrong, but did I hear the giggle of a certain dicky knee? Yeah, yeah, he did, dude. Did. He's even dressed like Dicky Knee today. So how the fuck did you know Get that? Get a better fucking knee mat, brand you fucking cunt. <laughs> how did you know that his knee was <laughs> fucked? <laughs> fuck? Jack- no, I'm really a- sorry. I'm back. <laughs> I'm so insecure and I'm projecting all of them on you. I'm sorry, Matt. The lie's actually on Matt. Jackson oh, is fuck. here. Come on, Matt. <laughs> hey! hey! He's not here because I've been watching the front. Oh, yeah, no, he's not here. Damn it. I watch the front guard every time. <laughs> Spread right. my fucking sister's lips, cunt. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> I'm trying. I really want to be part of your family. <laughs> oh, really? Matthew O'Doherty. <laughs> Matthew O'Doherty. I take her last name. <laughs> oh, anyway, Jackson. All right, man. We'll let you go. But we'll Can, see what should we lie to Lockie about? Oh. <laughs> 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 All right, guys, we're going to do a PO box. Matt going to turn, twist his stiff body around and press a button. Is there a PO box? Uh, there's a PO box. Yeah, yeah. Have a play with it. Get that over here. Have a little play with it. Have we got a fucking fucking? No, we don't have no, one. What? Lied. Oh, we got a little package. Oh. It's in like. Um, you haven't ordered anything, have Fuzzy. you? Fuzzy! No, we haven't ordered anything. It's read what it's from. All the- this is um, directed to Michael. Ooh. This is. Who is it from? Um, It is from Shane Meyer um, from, from Fluorescent. Fluorescent? Is that fluorescent? All right, Larissa. Yeah, I think so. It doesn't matter. Anyway, it's from America. We have all the. All right, let's open it and then my. Um, it's so this uh, is for Michael specifically. Apparently. All right. Well, Michael, here you go. We, we have all, all the. the Fuck. Oh no. We have is it hair? Uh, I don't know. All the- there's a letter and there's a oh, frame. What have we got here? It's Lord of the. Oh, oh what is it? Oh. That's surely for Marty. Oh he said God. it's addressed to Michael. Maybe they got our names wrong. That happens all the time. Bosley, yeah. come here. Bosley, oh. come on. Oh, my baby. <laughs> what, what is it? Is it a, the, what so is it's it? it's magnets on the back. Oh, Boz. we can put it on the oh, fridge. Oh, yes. Come here, darling. Come on, darling. You little limp. Here come on, come boy. Here oh, come. my little come on, Hello, Bosley. Look at this, darling. Hello, Bosley. Hello. <laughs> oh, my gosh, I love you. Oh. I love you. Yeah. Oh. Good boy, oh. boy, Bozzy. Shake that off. Shake that sexual off. Sit down. Sit. No, it might be too uncomfortable for his old joints out here. You reckon? Maybe, but thank you so much for whoever did yeah, this. Yeah, that's so cool. Oh, I'll be putting this on the fridge, and now we can we can stick things to the fridge magnet. Is okay. It, oh no, or is it sticky? It's, I don't know. It comes from a, a sad story. Oh shit! Oh shit! His oh, dog died. Shit. Hey boys, long time ringworm from the states. I'll make this quick. I lost my dad due to dementia, and we are finding out the dumb things he did due to him losing his mind. Yeah. He cancelled the house insurance, which we need a new roof for my mum. It leaks horribly. There is mold on the ceiling that my mum has to deal with. I'm on disability and can't help mum physically or money-wise. I have a GoFundMe set up, so if you could please help spreading it with social media. I've never been this desperate. I need to make sure my mum is safe. I don't know how to share this. If you could go to GoFundMe.com and share and search Shane Meyer with M-E-Y-E-R, it would help more than you could imagine. All see you demented duo in the UOM Facebook group. Thanks for your time, Shane Meyer. What, has he got the link to the GoFundMe? So this, I guess that's the process. Go to GoFundMe.com and type in Shane Meyer, M-E-Y-E-R, and let's help him out. Well, should we put it in the the GoFundMe, the link in the description? If we can find it. Yeah. Um, also- I'll write a note. This, I don't want this to start a, um, a tidal wave of GoFundMe gifts being sent in so please um be aware that we we can't share everyone's as much as we would love to we get like 
probably 50 requests a day to share GoFundMe. So if we, if we can't choose one over the other, you know what I mean? Because then the more we choose, then we get fucking people just sending in all these terrible, terrible stories. So if you want to support, what was his name, Shane? Shane Meyer, M-E-Y-E-R. Search that on GoFundMe.com. Let's help him get a new ceiling. Good luck out there, Shane. Fucking hang in there, mate. Go to Manscaped.com. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, fuck me. Let's move right along, eh? Let's move uh, right. Should we do a quick screaming segment? Go on. I reckon. Or what, what about Tales from Bethlehem? <laughs> have you gone? Well, I don't know. I was trying to think of a funny story that when we used to live with James. What's a funny night you could discuss of something that funny that happened when we used to live at James's? Have we told the, the Christmas night story? Because I, I found photos of it the other day. Oh, yeah, where Michael got so shit-faced he passed out by like midnight and then me and James just stayed up because <laughs> we put a roast in the oven at 1 a.m. So dumb, but we're so hungry. <laughs> And Three then, hours that thing had to cook, <laughs> and Michael was fully passed out. So we're just like, let's let's have some oh, fun with him. It was the such funniest, a beautiful Christmas. Funniest part was, yeah. So this is like Christmas Day. We just all all our friends hung out. I started. I just got this the big salt shake and I put it on full open, and we just pour salt into Michael's slightly agape mouth. <laughs> as he was sleeping and just fucking heaps of it and it would just stay there and nothing happened to it. It would have been <laughs> so dehydrated. The photos, dude, terrible. The photos are so good because you can see the progression. You can see like there's a bit of marker on your face and then your mouth is full of salt and then like it goes forward to the last photo where you just have like a light sprinkle of piss of your, your face and body that's like yellow drops everywhere. You're just pissing on my face. Do you remember James would get the We'd get in the mouth. One hundred percent. You had some piss in the mouth. <laughs> That's fuck. It would have like yeah. fully like wet the salt and pushed it yeah. down my throat. Yeah, it would have, yeah, it would have like it. It dissolved. Yeah, the salt. Fuck and getting the, remember getting the the, br <laughs> the broom. So nice. We got a broom and would would hit the bristles into your face as hard as we could. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like I was dying, Would dude. I, I wake couldn't up breathe. Not really. You'd stir no. sometimes, but no, you're <laughs> fucking gone, cunt. <laughs> See, imagine if we had oh, phones back then. Oh, oh, so you've phones got the progression night. on photos. We could turn that yeah. into all your old vids into a website vid. I could be oh, one of your yeah. stories from the chairs. Yeah. The yeah I was everything. watching all of the videos from our road trip. It was fucking amazing. Yeah. Some fun to watch. Yeah. Would, yeah. Were there iPhones back then? There would have been. Eh? There must have been because I'm literally going through. Oh, what and we I did remember each we were day. doing vines and shit, remember? Yeah. So Vine that's was right. around. Yeah. <coughs> um, Very good. Good times. Yeah, fucking oath. But anyway, that's our tale from Bethlehem this week. <laughs> <laughs> it was like a little Bethlehem, that house. It was. <laughs> where, man, there was some sick shit that went in there. My We've, poor born again Christian sister oh, who thought her God. lovely younger brother was looking after the house respectfully. Oh, man. Dude, remember yeah. we put porn on play at 100 full volume and then later on the TV would be off we'd hear the neighbours just having really quiet general chat. It like, was probably a metre away that oh, house. So man. they would have been having to listen to <laughs> oh, 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 fuck me horror fuck me horror Yeah, we just had a nest on the ground. Yeah. Didn't, yeah. That's all I didn't remember. One of, didn't someone bring a girl yeah, home? Yeah, that's why we put the porn on many, so loudly. Many yeah. And Michael picked up dog shit and carried it in and yeah, said hey look at this himself on yeah it. that's right that was oh, another man. time oh the videos from that were great with the drum kit and yeah the, the drum kit yeah and the stabbing yeah the, i think they're gone there was now. a keyboard but dude the stabbing dude. videos i wish we because fuck we used to like really push it with that oh, oh we still yeah. got those miss you guys but like i, I used to do this game when we were hammered oh. drunk Oh my god! Imagine if that fucking oh, ever went dude. wrong. I yeah, didn't well, even consider Luke that. Luke actually stabbed my face was, on New Year's. I was so oh. confident with it every time. So confident, I knew nothing would go wrong. Just go, boom, stab, stab, like this far away from the boys' heads and arms yeah, and shit. We just knew if Marty comes into the room with a knife, stay, stay still. still. <laughs> don't move. Don't try and leave. Just yeah. have to stay still and get oh, through it. I take risks sometimes and put my hands <laughs> oh, up. No. Oh, well, Marty oh. would do ones where he go, and then he go, and he go upwards <laughs> with it, <laughs> like yeah, just. 
Oh, very man. scary. He oh. wasn't selfish though. He'd do it to himself as well. Like he'd sort of be stabbing and turn it on himself. And <laughs> and I just realised you and a knife is dangerous. Remember yeah. you cut your you cut the cord. You were trying to. You were so oh, fucked. Yeah. And you were cutting bread and you cut through a cord. No, I was cutting of a toaster. Cutting too. cheese. Oh, I was then, cheese. You know when you just get through Dude. the cheese, it you just keeps gliding on. through. Yeah. And it just bash, went oh. through the fucking. Oh. You yes, also blew up the power. Did you have your hand on the blade? Yeah, yeah pushing down on the blade and then it, it cut through the electric wire hook to the toaster. Did it give you a zap? Oh yeah, dude. Wow. It took it's a chunk a, out of the knife. Yeah, a big black chunk missing Whoa. out of the knife and it, it, my arm just exploded backwards. Oh, Holy God. fuck, you could be dead. I know. Two yeah. times in this podcast, blanket knife. Yeah, that's and you, it. You also nearly killed Boz one night at New Year's. Marty had a sex doll and he was hacking at it with a knife. I've got it on video. And Boz comes up and thinks you're bashing someone. Oh! So he wants to get in on it. Mm -hmm. And you're hitting away. And Dave, who sent us a stick, is like, watch for Bosley, watch for Bosley. And you go, whack. And he goes right near his head. Oh, he my nearly God. I killed Bosley. That. Yeah, I've got it on video. I'll try and find Oh, my that. God. Imagine. We've got a whole bunch of videos we've got to resurface up. Yeah. Um, we'll call it the resurface video. Yeah. No, what we'll, we'll call I it. I like um, Tales of Bethlehem. Bethlehem right? Tales. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Just like sitting and talking. <laughs> yeah. yeah. About how good the times used to be. Now look. <laughs> now you get a brownery. This is fucking great. It is all right. It's got I no suppose. joints. A blue. It's a blue Strap, house. Strap knee. A blue brownery. Anyway. <laughs> a blue brownery? Is it blue? <laughs> is it? A house, yeah. All right. Let's do a fucking prank call. Your time is there for us to waste. Picking up your phone was your first mistake. Ha 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 ha. It's prank call time. Ah, uh, hello, mein Name ist Martin. Uh, ist da einer, der ein bisschen Deutsch reden kann? Sorry? Uh, ist da ein Deutscher da? Sorry, man, I can't understand. Uh, uh, warte ein bisschen. Uh, oh Gott, Knut, Knut, kannst, kannst du mal bitte sagen? Yes. Die, I? Ah, uh, hello, um, is this, uh, yeah. Is it what? Sorry, my brother is German. Um, what's who's this? This is a Bavarian restaurant in Chermsburg. Ich ich will bitte hier Armbrot haben vielleicht morgen Nacht. Oh, my brother's wanting to book a table. Sorry, he's German. I want to speak to someone. Yeah, that's fine. Where do you want to book it, mate? Um, are you? Have you got a German? Actually, he wants a German employee. Beg your pardon? Have you got a German employee? Sorry, I'm just busy. Uh, no. Ihr habt keinen Deutscher da bei, bei Bavaria? Wie kannst du das denn sagen, wenn er keinen Deutscher habt? Ah, oh, he's upset because of Bavaria. Uh, ja, das, a, wenn, wenn, du, wenn, du Deutsch, wenn du deutsches äh, Essen machen willst, dann, dann, dann musst du einen Deutscher da haben. Das, das kann ja wohl nicht wahr sein. Yeah, sorry. He's just a bit... Yeah, he's just gotten to us. That's okay. I do have a German employee here, but they're born and brought up here, so they don't speak German though. Oh, they don't. Okay, all right. Yeah, yeah. They are background German, but they're born and brought here, so they speak very local. No, das, was ist das für ein Scheiß? Das, das, das glaube ich gar nicht. Yes. Yeah, uh, ein bisschen Bier trinken. Alberto. Ein Bier trinken. Sorry, sorry. He's just. Oh, mein Arschloch juckt auch so. Oh, you, you can mein Arsch für mich. You can mein Arsch für mich hier. Oh, Fliege. Ich hab einen Fliege in mein Auge. Um, so, yeah, I guess we'll get him a table. He's just, uh, maybe not tonight. But um, yeah, so you've guys got bookings ah, that we can do tomorrow. Arsch. Hey, fick mich am Arsch, du Kleiner. Hey, fick mich am Arsch. Albert? Yeah, so can we, can we book a table for tomorrow night? Sorry, he, he, he's... Yeah, mate. So there's no German... How many people? Like, is it German food he wants to know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got pork taco, pork belly, uh, schnitzels. Oh. Schnitzel? Yeah. Hab ich jetzt Schnitzel gehört? Oh, ja, ich, ein bisschen Schnitzel für Armbrot morgen. Mm, okay. Ja, ein bisschen Huhnschnitzel. Was, was, was tut yes, er da yes, drauf? Yes, yes, Albert. Yes, yes, ja, 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 was noch? Yeah, was yeah, noch okay. Deutsch? All right. What did, else German? Did just what all... else German did I have? Yeah, just what else German? Oh, we got German beers, German schnaps. Schnaps? Uh, was ist hier Schnaps gesagt? Oh, ja, ein bisschen Schnaps, bitte. Oh, um, habt ihr uh, uh, Ananas, yeah, Schnaps we'll oder was? Tomorrow, uh, so you just come in or do you, must, uh, do you have to make a booking? No, no, you can just have to pay on the spot. What, what, other, German foods do they have? what, what other German foods do they have? What other? So we got knuckle, pork belly, we got schmacknels, uh, which is uh, pork belly, German schnitzels, uh, German sausages, like uh, the tasting platter. 
Oh, Schnitzel, ja, bitte. Ein mm, bisschen Schnitzel für mein, mit meinem okay, Bier. Was für ein Bier? Yeah, what what kind of German beers do they have? Yeah, what, what beers do you have, mate? Uh, German beers. My delivery comes at first. I've got four different German beers. It's got Kaiser Dom Kalimbrau. Oh, uh, Kaiser Dom Kalimbrau. Ja, oh, Lohmbrau. Ja, ja, bitte. Uh, oh, Lohmbrau. Lager. Oh, uh, Lager. Ja, bitte. Oh, mit dem Schnaps. Mit dem Schnaps und Schnitzel, bitte. Yeah, all right. Well, I guess we'll see you tomorrow night, mate. That's great. Thank you very much. No worries, mate. So good. Thank you. Cancel it! Cancel it! Gotcha. Oh my god, dude. Because I realized halfway through, I can't talk German back. Yeah, I realized that too, so I just gave up on trying and started saying things in English. Oh, so, oh fuck me, oh. dude. That was. We wasted that man's time. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. But at least we know now if you want to go to the Bavarian, yeah, they've they got, got some all good those, shit. all that food there. Yeah, like all free, free bloody press for them, free bloody advertising for Elbert them. Elbert the dogs. German. <laughs> we helped. So yeah, that, but yeah, man, how can that, was that all German that you were saying? Uh, yeah, yeah. That wasn't gibberish. Oh, some of it towards the end was, yeah, gibberish. Man, I love the, um, <laughs> the, you break into English real, real direct English. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What kind of beers did I have? What kind of beers I have? <laughs> oh yeah, he heard two different voices before. <laughs> You're just saying what he's already yeah, hearing yeah. again. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Michael trying like like losing it a bit and then having to come back. Very good. <laughs> oh, yeah, right. very, very, anyway. very, very. Welcome, tight. Albert. <clears throat> anyway, all right, guys. That is the end of episode number twenty-three. Um, I got uh, age restricted, so just remember to search our channel. Uh, there's probably heaps of episodes you've missed because all the age restricted episodes don't get any views and shit. It's pretty funny when we, when that happens. We all sit down and laugh and shit when they. What should we do? Any suggestions of what uh, yeah. we should do? Look, get smoke bongs, man. Yeah, smoke bongs yeah. and, and hang out more. Yeah, I think that's a good plan. <laughs> and, and play some place worms. Start. No, worms. look, we'll see if we can get it figured out, all right? By the end of the season, we'll be squeaky clean. No more fuck jugs, nothing coming. Maybe we just reformat the podcast and just, like, do a book club or yeah, something. Yeah, like, it could be, like, a children's oh, podcast. Yeah. Oh, sticker! Blatton. Sticker club! Sticker club! Oh, oh my God. Well, I know about too that. much. Yeah, too yeah, much. Sorry, fuck that. Anyway, that, we'll see you later, guys. We're the best <laughs> sort of, <laughs> apart from <laughs> the age restriction. We're the best, 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 we you have all the questions and we have all the answers and we've got lots of dances for you. 